have a look at how Algae Discs support uh, problem solving and help to develop reasoning. We've got a question here about how many hours in a week a lady works. So I'll read it first. A woman works two tea hours each day from Monday to Friday. She works two T minus Y hours on Saturdays. She does not work on Sundays. The first part of the question asks to express her working hours in a week in terms of T and Y. The second part asks how many hours does she work each week when T equals 4 and Y equals 3. Do you want me to go on and do the rest? No T, so I'm going to swap the T and represent the T using a Y. So I'm going to model the problem first and have a look at the days of the week. So we've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. But I know that she doesn't work on Sundays. So every day she works two T hours. I'm going to represent it with X. So she's got every day working two X hours apart from Saturday. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, each day is two X hours. Saturday she works two X minus Y hours. And we could look at that now and think, does she work more hours on a Saturday because there are more discs? Or does she work fewer hours on a Saturday? And we could ask the children to explain their understanding and explain their reasoning using the discs. So, first part of the question, express her working hours in a week in terms of X and Y. So, we can see quite clearly that we've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 lots of X and a negative Y. And that's how many hours in the week she will be working in terms of X and Y. The second part is how many hours does she work each week when X equals 4 and Y equals 3. So each X represents 4 hours. So I'm going to use the algae disks to show this. So I've got 1, 2, 3, 4 hours for each of the X's. 